Hi guys, my name is Ferdy and in this video I want to show you how you can get a Graviter account with an image. If I install a WordPress website and I use a new email address, it looks like this. You see my name over here and then you see my profile picture and that does not look professional. So when you have a blog post for instance on your website and below the blog post you see something like about the author, and you see this image over here, it does not look good. So how can you get an image over here? I go to the back end of my WordPress website. I go to users, your profile. I scroll down and I see this is the email address I use. And this email address is not linked with a Graviter account. How can you get one? Over here at profile picture, it says you can change your profile picture on Graviter. So I go over there. It costs about $500 per month. No, I'm just kidding. It's totally free. I click on create your own Gravatar. This is by the way, my one of my first jokes in years because in English it's hard to do jokes for me, but I'm trying to learn it. My email address is ferdycorpershook at gmail.com. My username will be ferdycorp2 or 1 because I have one already. And my password is this one. I click on continue, save it. Awesome, give us a minute and we'll move right along. I need to confirm my email address. So I click over here. I say activate account. Okay. Sign in to Gravatar. I click over here. Okay. Whoops. Looks like you don't have any images yet. Add a new image. I click over here. And if you don't see that, you can click over here. Add an image. I upload a new one choose a file, I go to the desktop and over here I choose this image. I open it and I click on next. This is okay, I click on crop image and I click on set rating. That's it. Now I need to wait for a while so I will be back with you. It can take a few minutes before your image is visible here so I refresh the page. And there it is. So if I would go to my website, Ferdy Pro, you see the image over here. And not only here, if I post a blog post and below it says something about the author, you'll see my image. And when I go to a WordPress website and I leave a reply somewhere and I use the same email address, I also will see this image. So that's how you can do it. Thank you for watching this video. Have an amazing day and you'll see me the next time. Bye bye.